caught on camera, two masked men holding up a postal worker at gunpoint. What started as a normal day on his delivery route turned into a terrifying situation for this unsuspecting mailman. Thank you for joining us. I'm David Wade. And I'm Lisa Hughes. WBZ's Brandon Truitt is in Nashua, New Hampshire, giving us a closer look at the security video police hope will catch these thieves. People who live around here tell me this mail carrier has been on the route for years. A lot of them saw the video and say they're stunned this happened here. It's just, it, it's shocking. For him to have to even be put through that, it, it's scary. People who live around here say they cannot believe what happened in their quiet neighborhood. This video shows a beloved postal worker return to his truck, then two people approach him with masks on and guns drawn. The postal worker appears to comply and hands the gunman something. Neighbors say the mailman told them they were after his master key. Police say the two gunmen jumped in a getaway car driven by a woman. It was a dark colored Yukon with Massachusetts plates. Everybody's losing their peace of mind knowing that this person is still out there. Myron Rodriguez Nunez lives here and praised the postal worker for his composure, noting this incident happened just moments before the bus dropped off kids from school. You know, I have four kids of my own. There's plenty of other children that are outside here on a daily basis, day in, day out. We moved here about six months ago um, just because it was quiet, calm comfortable neighborhood. Sky Eye shows police on scene moments after this robbery. They comb this scene before removing the postal truck. The U.S. Postal Service confirms the suspects got away with U.S. Postal property, but with guns drawn in the middle of the day, neighbors say they are aware this could have been so much worse. To hear about this, it, it's really scary because now it's like, are we safe? I, I thank God that nobody had to find out or, you know, suffer from any consequences because these are people's livelihoods. That postal worker was shaken up, but otherwise uninjured. This kind of armed robbery is a serious federal offense. It comes with up to 25 years in prison. In Nashua, New Hampshire, Brandon True at WBC News. Brandon, thank you.